Hey, what's up? And next we're going to go over uh, a basic Docker setup, an Nginx setup uh, using Terraform. So I have a completely empty directory here and I'm going to make a file uh, just to get started. See, there's nothing in here. We're just going to make a file called main.tf. And in that file, I'm going to paste the following. So uh, you got Terraform, Required Providers, and be Docker. And this is going to be my source from Docker. Here's my version. And here's my provider from Docker. And then the resource I'm going to make is a Docker image uh, named Nginx. And I'm just going to grab the latest. And it's not going to be local. And then I'm going to create a container called Nginx from that image and then just name it tutorial. And then I'm just going to have the internal port 80 to external port 8,000. Okay, so that's uh, when I'm doing this on Windows, so make sure you know that too. So inside of here, I'm gonna initialize this with Terraform in it. Cool. And I got my lock file, and then I'm just gonna do a Terraform plan so we can check this out. No changes, and then I'm gonna do Terraform uh, apply and you see there's nothing nothing going on right let me save this now you can see it all right so could not load plug plug in right so it says to reinitialize so terraform in it let's reinitialize this i didn't save the file that's why all right so now we've got this saved now i can run terraform apply all right so let's just say yes to start building it and we got our Docker image being created. And then once the image is created, I'm just going to make a container out of that image. And then that'll be it. So um, I should be able to go to localhost on port 8000 and see this uh, Docker container running. If you don't have Docker desktop installed for Windows, I highly recommend it. Um, you should start getting getting familiar with Docker so that we can move on to Kubernetes. So you should have a uh, Docker desktop for Windows installed. Um, some of the stuff you see, people are going to tell you that you need to have Windows sub subsystem for Linux, but you can still run this on, on, uh, uh, on Windows. So I opened Docker desktop and you can see here uh, I've got this this running on port 8000. So in my images, I've got my Nginx image, and then uh, my volumes, and then my containers, I've got this tutorial running, and then I can open this in my browser, and see here in Chrome, localhost port 8000, welcome to Nginx. So that's it, you just used uh, Docker to deploy a Docker container, uh, with a Docker image running Nginx and we can just see the default Nginx page and running containers of Docker is just that simple. So I'm running it on my machine. So eventually you're going to want to get off your machine and move this into the cloud somewhere. Or if you have a Kubernetes cluster or something uh, in a home lab, you know, somewhere like that. But uh, that's the basics of how you would run uh, a Docker container on a Windows PC. So if you have any questions, let me know. But if not, uh, then I guess I'll just catch you in the next one.